During the COVID-19 pandemic, teaching practice was abruptly moved to remote and virtual environments, affecting, according to UNESCO, more than 220 million tertiary students. Many challenges arose, revealing that education systems around the world were poorly prepared to harness the potential of existing technologies and to ensure the maximum quality in their implementation. This massive disruption has put the spotlight on digital transformation. But how can we ensure that the foundations of HEIs are enhanced rather than constrained by technology? There is no single formula to approach the digital transformation of higher education institutions, but the best practices around the world have taken into account three core dimensions. The educational model, the technological model, and the organizational model. As the world's first digitally native university, at the UOC we know that addressing the digital transformation of universities means shaking their very foundations and rethinking the universities themselves. And this is a never-ending path. Indeed, last year at the UOC, we launched a strategic plan on digital transformation. We are working in four main areas, research and innovation to foster e-learning research and knowledge transfer to society and other institutions, the digital divide, focusing on digital skills for students and for teachers, the access device, providing scholarships and also working to improve the experience of our students. And fourth, advocating for the improvement of educational systems. In a nutshell, this plan is allowing us to change and to help others to change too. During the last year, many institutions and universities have contributed to the debate on digital transformation and shared their experiences, practices, and knowledge for a real and transformative digitalization. The digital world opens up an exceptional window for observing and recognizing needs and opportunities. Return to campus have to be seen as an opportunity to change and improve what we did before as well as to design better blended or hybrid models. There will probably be more universities embracing these hybrid or branded models, but face-to-face -face and fully online ones will stay because it's not about the institution. It is about a different profile of students these institutions have to serve. Assessment is another of the topics that has become an issue when transforming education. We need to transform the way we assess and we have to integrate the digital dimension also in the assessment approaches and practices. Finally, when everything is increasingly going to be recorded and maybe monitored, it's very important to create mechanisms and systems that enable us to use this data with the necessary privacy and diligence in place so that we can have more information about our students and their needs. Critical data governance, including training for students and teachers for their appropriate use, is also a necessary issue we have to face. We have in front of us an exciting opportunity for rethinking the educational system. Let's take the best of digital transformation and make it more diverse, inclusive, and sustainable. Let's make quality education for all a reality.